Hello and welcome to Katrina's Creations. It's another yarn sale day. I have a whole table full. Let's get started. Information ahead of time. If you're interested in anything that you see, please contact me over at Katrina's Creations at yahoo.com or you can message me over on Facebook at Katrina Knits. Now how I am working this is um, I will tell you the price of the item and then it'll be that price plus whatever the shipping is. And what I did with the last two yarn sales was I went ahead, mailed it to you. It's kind of on the honor system. I mail it to you um, once I know what the shipping price is going to be. And then you can either send me a check or you can um, pay me through PayPal or Venmo. So let's get started. The first thing I have is a huge bag full of all different types of lace weight yarn. I used to knit a lot with lace weight. As I've gotten older, I don't knit with lace weight anymore, but there is pinks and reds. There is a white mohair here and gray, uh, yellow, black. So yes, lots and lots of lace weight yarn. So the cost of this is $10 for everything, so it'd be $10 plus whatever the shipping costs. So that's item number one. I have no idea what the yardage, um, because some of it is yarn that I bought off of eBay from China, and I don't read Chinese, so I don't know for certain. If you hear noise in the background, Dave is restringing one of his mandolins and is tuning it, so you, every so often you'll hear mandolin uh, stuff in the background. The next item I have, is a very large amount of 100% wool. I will take one of these out. I do not know the yardage. I do know that it is a sweater quantity. I made a sweater and I think it was like a size, maybe a 3X, 2X, something like that. Um, here it is. I made this sweater and I finished it and it was just too bulky and it was too big for me. So I took the whole thing apart. But there is quite a bit here. And this is 100% wool. It's in an antique gold color. And there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven and a half balls worth of yarn here. So, uh, yes, good amount of yarn. There are some areas where um, I've cut and tied some of the yarn together because like I said, this was part of a sweater. So once I took it back apart, but definitely usable. So the price for this one is also $10 for all of the yarn there. Okay, the next one is a knit crate yarn and I only have one skein, which is really weird. I have no idea where the rest of this is because it usually came in two skein bundles. But I did buy at one point a mystery box, and I think this might have been one of the skeins from this. This is Vitalana Celestial. The color is called Europa. It's 90% alpaca, 10% uh, tencel. It's an Aran weight, and there's 150 yards in it. It is really, really soft, and it is a rust color as you can see here. So the cost for this is $10. Okay. Let's see, the next is another bag full of yarn. This is a mix. Some of this is lace weight, some of it is more of a soft, well it's not really, a, it, I'd say it's all fingering weight. The yellow is slightly thicker then the other color, let me take it out of the bag so you can see what the skeins look like. Again, it is in Chinese, so I cannot tell you what it is. It is a, I do know it's a cotton bamboo mix. Here we go. So here is the purple. So there you can see the purple. And here is the yellow. So you can see the yellow is slightly thicker than the purple, 
but I actually put these two together because you can see the yellow that is in here is the same color yellow as here. And there are one, two, three, four, five skeins of the yellow and there is three skeins of the purple. I don't know the yardage in it. I do know it was quite a bit, but again, it's in Chinese. Um, I do know it's, it says it's 50 grams. That I can make out. And it says bamboo, this it does say in English, bamboo cotton cashmere, uh, but it does not have a yardage on it. But I do know it is extremely soft. And does it say anywhere I can try to find anything to do with yardage? No, I can't see anything in it. But um, yeah, it's it's very soft. It like I said, it is bamboo, so it's nice to work with. And the total for this is eight dollars. The next is another knit crate yarn. It is two skeins. It is called Vitalana Dusk. The colorway is Brains. And there's two of them. And it is a 60% Huakaya Alpaca, 40% Surrey Alpaca. It's a DK weight. Uh, there are 231 yards per skein, so it's a total of 462 yards. And it's kind of, it's it looks total green, but let's see if I can get it to focus. You can see it's kind of tonal. There's some darker areas in it. Again, it is really, really soft because of all the alpaca in it. So it's two different types of alpaca. And the only reason I'm getting rid of some of these knit crates uh, yarns is because I don't have anything to put with them and I have plenty of stuff to wear around my neck. Two skeins is not gonna make like a shawl. It's not gonna make, you know, it's more like hats and things unless you've got something you can put it with and this green didn't match any of the other greens I have. So um, yeah, so this one is 25. The next one, I showed this in the last sale because I thought I had three skeins. I have four. I found a fourth one. So I have four skeins of this. They are, you can buy anywhere from one to four. They're gonna be $10 per skein. So if you get all four, it's $40. Uh, if you buy two, it's $20, you know, you get the idea. $10 per skein for the Wired. And it's called Wired, it is a Uru yarn. Um, it is a 40% Huakaya alpaca, 30% Surrey alpaca, and 30% wool. There's 150 yards per skein. Um, so it's basically a worsted weight. And like I said, I have up to four available skeins for $10 per skein. Clouds. I have another one-off yarn. I think, again, this came in a mystery box. Um, or at one point I was getting a sock box. It came from one of those. This is called Cloud Sock. It is Audine Wools. There you can see it. It is, of course it's a sock weight yarn. There is, let's see, the, the content is 60% superwash merino, 30% mohair, 10% nylon. It's a fingering slash sock weight. There's 400 yards per skein. The color is called Wolf Moon, and it is blue with like black flecks in it. They might be showing up as blue, but they are black flecks into it. And this particular skein is 1250 for that. The next one is one that is very popular. Um, lots of people were looking for this at one point and I knew I had one somewhere and I finally found it. It got buried underneath some things. This is Citrus Squeeze, which at one point there was a lot of people looking for it on eBay. Uh, but this is a Knitology Cozy Sock. This was part of a sock uh, base 
when I think it was part of their sock set because it was only one. That's all I had. Um, it is 75% superwash merino wool, 15% nylon, and 10% cashmere. Yeah, it is soft. It's a fingering weight and there's 439 yards in this skein. So quite a bit of yardage for one skein of yarn. Uh, this one is $15. I put it up a little bit just because I know that there was a lot of people looking for it because it was like a one-off thing that they did. The next one I have, I'm asking what I paid for it. I got it on sale someplace. Um, I paid $3.60, so that's what I'm asking for it. It is Kramer Yarns, 200 yards. It is a purple. It's a deep purple. There you can see it. It's like grape, a grape color. 200 yards. It is 30% wool merino blend and 70% acrylic. So it is a worsted weight. Yeah, so there is that. And this one, like I said, is 360. I'm just asking what I paid for it. Now I have an Ella Ray, and it's also a purple, but it's kind of a heathered, kind of a heathered purple. There you can see it has little different tones in it. It's also kind of a grape color, but you can see that there's some other colors mixed in with it. It is a sport weight yarn. Uh, let's see if I can see what the yardage is. 164 yards. It's 100% wool. Not superwash, it's just 100% wool. It's LRA Classic Sport. And this is $5. Next I have, let's see, another Knit Crate yarn. This is Knitology Swirl. It is a light uh, purple, as you can see. And it is 65% superwash merino, 35% surrey alpaca. It is a worsted weight and there's 225 yards per skein. So it's a total of 450 yards all total. And that one is $25. Like I said, I'm charging what I paid. Um, let's see. And you can't get Knit Crate anymore, so it went out of business, sadly. The next is Universal Yarn. It's 100% wool. It's called Wisdom Yarns, but it's from Universal Yarn. Uh, the, let's see, there are 109 yards per skein. It looks like a worsted weight. Does it say? I don't think it says. It doesn't say, but it's a worsted weight. Um, yeah, I have two of these. I don't even see a color listed on them. It just says colors by Cornelia Tuttle Hamilton. Hmm, doesn't even... It just has a number. It's color 605. But here's what it looks like. They're different shades of tan and it is a single ply Let's see if i can get it to focus here there you can see it it is a single ply yarn so there is a little gray in it you can see it right in here and over in here but it's tans and gray so this is Universal Yarns. It is both skeins and that's $8. So it's $4 per skein. The next is also another Knit Crate yarn. So it's two skeins. These are also single, single ply. It is Knitology. And let's see, it was called Fresh Start. 
uh, 60% merino, 10 or 20% nylon, 20% alpaca. It's a fingering weight. There's it is 440 yards per skein, so a total of 880. So you can make a decent shawl with this. Um, and it is the colors fresh start. It kind of is very spring colored. So there you can see it. And it is a single ply. So there you can see that. The colors are showing up pretty true to color. And so this is 25. The next is also a knit crate yarn. This is Uru yarn called Sugared Sport. It is a deep grape color purple with silver sparkles in it. The, let's see, it's called Lapis. And it is 70% superwash merino, 20% nylon, 10% stellina. Stellina is the sparkly stuff. It is a sport weight. There's 300 yards per skein. So it is a total of 600 yards together here. It is really pretty. Um, I have found that sometimes the sparkly things itch for me. I don't know if it's a, an allergy or if it's just sensitive for whatever. So I've, that's why I've got this up for sale, but it is a really pretty deep purple with sparkly. So this is 25. Next I have some mohair. This is, it's called kitten mohair, not from a cat, kitten mohair. And it is, uh, let me see, it's a 50 gram ball. It only has it in meters because it's a European yarn apparently, looking at some of the writing. Um, let's see if I can see anything. Uh, 165 meters. So I have one and a partial skein of this. It's navy blue. It is really, really soft. I used it combined with something, and so I've got like half of the skein. So it's one and a half skeins, and the total for this is $5. Next I have, now if you want this, I will take it off of the cone just because it would ship a little bit cheaper. Uh, this is 100% wool. The color is showing up about right. It's kind of a, it's a, it is a green, kind of a sagey green. I have no idea how much yardage is here. I bought this from a warehouse up in Rhode Island. I do know that you had to buy um, in two pound lots. So I know that this is around two pounds of yarn. It is worsted weight. And if you do buy it, I will take it off of the, off of the cone and put it into Hanks for you because it would be a lot easier than paying the shipping for the cone and just the bulkiness. So this is $16 because when I bought it, it was $8 a pound and I know there's two pounds here. So I don't know the yardage, but two pounds is quite a bit. That's 16 ounces worth of yarn or 32 ounces of yarn. So uh, at least it might be slightly more than that. So this one here is $16. I also have a maroon one. It is also $16. It's also 100% wool. And again, if you were to buy it, I would take it off of the cone for you. Although this cone is not as heavy, but it would just be very bulky to try to ship so if you are interested, I will take it and put it into Hanks for you. The next is another Knit Crate yarn. This is called, uh, let's see, it's a Vitalana. The color is called Tapenade or Tapenade. It is beautiful. I have I made something out of this. I had like four skeins of this. So I've already used, like I made a cowl out of it. So I have two more skeins of this. Uh, let's see. 
I mean, these are the two skeins. The other two skeins I made into a neck scarf. Uh, so this is, let's see, 329 yards per skein. So it's 658, 658 altogether. It is really pretty because it is, it is a tonal green. And what's it made out of? 70% uh, superwash merino, 20% silk, 10% cashmere. It is a sport weight. So yes, it is really soft. Um, it was nice to work with. Like I said, I crocheted a neck cowl out of the other two skeins of this. So this is $25. And then the, oh, I have two more. Okay, this next one here is also a knit crate. They are not the same, but they are meant to go together. They came as, as a kit. And these are Audine Walls. This one is called Breathless, and this is called Dry Leaves, but they are meant to go together. They were in the same package together as a project, for a project. Uh, they both are sock weight. I'm just double checking to make sure the yardage and everything. They both are 400 yards each. Uh, they're both fingering weight. And they are both 80% superwash wool, 20% nylon. So you actually could make socks out of these. Um, or you could do another project out of it. So altogether it is 800 yards between the two. But yes, even though they are different, they were packaged to go together as the project for that knit crate box. So this is $25. And then the last one that I have is another bag. It is Katya yarn. There's two skeins of it. It's a total of three skeins. So the these two, um, and I have not used any of it. The ball band broke and it started to unravel, so I had to kind of put it back together again, but I haven't used any of this. It is Katya Oxford. It is 50% wool, 45% acrylic, 5% viscose. And the color is, it's just number 211. And there are 137 yards per skein. So these are both the same color. They're kind of a tweed. It is single plied, as you can see. So, yeah, these two. And then there's a third one that I put with it. I had them packaged like this because I intended to use these together. And this is another with wool, but as you can see, the color in here is almost identical, which is why when I put these together, I intended to use them together. So they are all being sold together, make really pretty fall colors. Um, but anyway, this, there, it's composed of like a this kind of a rusty color and there's like a bluish denim color mixed in there and then some browns. So like I said, this goes nicely with it. And this all together is $10. So that is the yarn sale. Um, if you're interested, like I said, in any of these, please contact me at my Yahoo address, which is Katrina's Creations at Yahoo.com or message me over on KnitCrate um, and you can give, let me know what you want. Um, I'll verify the, the prices with you, let me know your address, and I'll get them mailed out to you, and then I will let you know what the total came to with the shipping, because the shipping depends so much on where it's going and the individual weight, and yeah. So I usually just, I do try to ship as cheaply as I can, and I try to squish things down as much as I can to keep, you know, keep it a as cheaply as possible. So, um, yeah, if you're interested in any of this, please let me know. Um, yes, Katrina's Yarn Shop is open for business right now. So, uh, yes. So if you're interested in any, just let me know. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you again on Saturday. Bye, everybody. Mm -hmm.